Hello and welcome to this video playing um, Jugala Ajugala. <laughs> okay, is this uh, little brother of Jorge <laughs> playing B3? <laughs> Maybe, yeah, you never know. Okay, I'm shooting for this one. Yeah, this is not a bad line for black, I think. This kind of setup, let's do this. You'll probably take knight f5 looks kind of weird. Um, yeah, anyway, I've gained a couple of points since the last video. In the last opponent, I disconnected after a couple of moves, so I didn't make a video out of that. Felt a little bit pointless. Okie dokie, what's this? Yeah, probably just take him. I would, my bishop is better off on d6 here, but still it's not bad. Got a very nice, easy development here. Bishop g4 is a good move to come, which he prevents. Okay, I cannot take on e3, I think. Sometimes possible and stuff like that. I wonder if bishop e3 is a move trading this. It's definitely not a bad move. Okay, let's do it. I've got very easy development here. Brook to d8, possibly c5, c4. Ideas like that. White has this uh, central majority. Four against three, but I'm not sure that this nets him much. That's why development is so good. Yeah, I don't mind that. I have c5 later. Queen wants to swing over to g5 anyway, so. Or to h5, not sure about it. Hmm. Okay, let's look at e3 first. So that f4 becomes less of an option. Okay. Yeah, this is what I wanted to provoke, but it probably didn't, doesn't do much. Right, it doesn't do much. Hmm. Yeah, that doesn't really do anything, queen g6. Hmm. Yeah, it was stupid, huh? Doesn't, didn't help at all. Let's just go, go away there. I thought I can do something on the king side. But um, this is just a complete illusion. C five is also not a not an ideal square by any stretch of the imagination. But um, it's what it is. And I put something on C3 here. Oh, he loves that, interesting. Isn't this a little bit annoying? B4, no. Don't think that B4 helps him. I'm okay with going to C4, I guess. Hmm. 
Mm. <laughs> yeah, this is not especially exciting. Yeah, it's hard Check. not to trade him. Probably have to. Yeah, it feels very equal. And maybe you can actually play rook d1 here. Yeah, that would be interesting. Shooting for rook to d7. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Slightly ahead on the clock at least. Position is just equal. Bishop f3, yeah. hmm, interesting. Trying to improve my back rank a little bit. Bishop d7. b6 and then c5 is the idea. Ah, okay, interesting. Okay, I mean, the, Check. No, the, that's a nice ending. Check. He still has, I mean, okay, nice ending. It's rather equalish. Still has some pawns on light squares, but it's probably not a big deal. Draw offered. Yeah, probably, yeah, probably it is a draw. Any way forward here? Yeah. Hmm, probably not. Time warning. No, but I don't see how I lose really, so let's try. Mm -hmm. C4, it's completely blocked after that. Yeah, okay. I don't have a way forward here, fortunately. C4 is probably playing more for a loss than for anything else. Draw offered. Draw offered. Yeah, I cannot do anything. I tried, but uh, it was ultimately very solid. Yeah, he says good game. Probably it was a good game. I mean, it felt like it was uh, pretty equalish all along the way. Yeah, probably my ideas here on the king side were kind of naive. And I went back and now there's not much going on. Oops. Sorry for that. Yeah, that knight to e. Um, Knight to c3 didn't didn't do anything. Hmm. It's probably Check. just very equal. Check. I mean at first you think that white might have something with this four against three on the king side. 
but he doesn't get a passer and I have some chances here on those pawns here they are on light squares so this is why why he went for this getting rid of the pawns I cannot do much here maybe I can play without c5 can I delay that a little bit but it's still a draw I guess <laughs> it's just um and just pretty pretty equal okay well thanks for watching